Namaste, everyone. Thank you very much for your presence here. Today, my topic will be the types of meditation. Basically, there's three types of meditation. The first one is one pointed concentration, the second, open monitoring, the third, is the self-awareness. I will go through one by one. Let's start from the one-pointed concentration first. So let's f- start from five senses. Now please shift to, uh, please have all your attention on your hands now. Feel your hands completely. Maybe there is tingling sensation. Now shift your attention to your feet. Feel the pressure between your feet and the ground. The cold or the warm sensations. Now let's shift your attention to your breath. Breath here, I mean the air flow in and out from your nostril. You may feel the gentle brushing from the air. Now let's look at any object in your surroundings. Could be your computer, or the table in front of you, any object. You just notice that you have all your attention watching the object. If there's thoughts arise, it's okay. You just shift your attention or bring back your attention to the object you're looking at, you're focused on. Just for a couple of seconds. Okay, that's the attention on the seeing objects. Now let's pay attention to your, to any sound you can hear. Could be the clicking sound from the, your clock. Or the buzzing sound from your computer or laptop. Any sound you can pick up. 
and try to focus there. If thoughts arise, don't pay attention, pay attention to the thoughts, let it go. Bring your attention back to the listening of the sound. Now the last one, feel your tongue now. The tongue in your mouth, just try to feel it. Maybe it's touching your upper palate or your teeth. Or maybe a gentle test in your mouth. Okay, that's the perceiving objects or sensations from the five sensory organs. Now let's go to the six, the thought, which includes your inner image. Let's say visualize a sun setting. Try to Stabilize that visualization of sun setting. It's beautiful. You're enjoying watching it. It's an inner image. Now, let's say pay attention to your next thought, if there's anyone. If there's any thought arising in your mind, you just let it go. Don't reject or resist. Don't follow. Let it come, let it go. The idea is that you have zero thought. And there's a thought to rise. It's okay, let it go. And it works. and waiting for the next one. It's like there's a cat waiting in front of the mouse hole, watching the mouse coming from the hole, but don't catch it. And you are the cat. The thought is a mouse. It's Okay, that's the first category of meditation. That's one object concentration, which means you focus on any 
object coming from your six sensory organs, including the thoughts. So namely your image in front of object in front of you, a sound, a smell, I mean from your nose, a taste from your tongue, and the body sensation from your touch. And the key is you're constantly focused there. You don't leave or lose your concentration even for one second. And try this for a couple, couple of minutes, good from two minutes from to from two minutes to ten minutes. It's a very good way to tame the monkey mind, slowly, slow it down. Now let's go to the next group of meditation, which is open monitoring. So, open, so instead of attach your attention to any object from the six sensory organs, you don't attach to any, uh, any one of it. Like you're perceiving all the objects and sensations, all the phenomena inside of you and outside of you as a whole. You just purely observe it. No resisting, no suppressing, purely observing, no nibbling, It's like you're doing the 360 degree of open monitoring. Three dimensional plus one time dimension because you're constantly monitoring it now. Okay, next, let me ask you, who is perceiving all this phenomena inside and outside of you? Who are you now? It's like you have all your attention from the open monitoring, from all the phenomena outside and inside of you, to look at the awareness itself. You are, all, you are aware of all the phenomena now, but your attention is like you turn, turn inwardly. Look at the awareness itself. So it's called self-awareness. The awareness is aware itself. If you can follow my pointing,
Congratulations. Now you have entered the source of everything. The real you, the true you, which is awareness itself, now is not interested or don't pay attention to any objects arise in it. It has shifted its attention to itself. It's the source of everything you're experiencing. At the same time, you will notice every sound, image, body sensation, breath, heartbeat, thoughts, emotions. You have much more clear picture, understand, understanding of them, all of these phenomena. You are the creator of your world. You are getting familiar with the awareness itself. It's ultimate, it's the ultimate goal of meditation. Recognize you as the awareness only, and the rest in, in it stabilize your realization, and the rest in it abide in it, and enjoy the beautiful dance of all the phenomena in you. Now you may understand truly the Jesus teaching. You are in the world, but you are not of this world. Because now one of your feet standing on your pure awareness, which is stable, calm, intellectual, never changing and another feet another feet your feet is in a dyna dynamic world the ever changing world in terms of sound image thoughts emotion all the movements outside and inside of you. What a beautiful realization it is. You are one with everything. And if, if you can practice this every day, wisdom may arise. and arise in terms of your direct experience. You may enjoy your life 
everyday life much deeper, happier, in a more constructive, creative, functional way. Enjoy. And the key is that you bring this kind of pure awareness in your everyday life, like in front of you there is a dynamic world, but in the background you're always aware, calm and peace, full of love. Okay, that's all for today. Thank you very much. A very great day. Bye now.